السلام عليكم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى عليه وصحبه وسلم أما بعد هبة في الله Be cautious of explaining the Quran based on your opinion or judgment Imam Abdulaziz al-Rajihi Hafidh Allah Ta'ala He mentions that Tafsir bi ra'i al-mujarrid haram Fala yujuz li ahad in yufassir al-Quran al-Kareem bi ra'i wal-hawa So he mentions that uh, making a tafsir or explaining the Quran based upon your opinions and strictly based solely based on your opinions and based on your desires is impermissible and that is impermissible for anyone to explain the Quran in that way وَقَدْ وَرَدَ وَعِيد شَدِيد لِمَنْ فَسَرَ الْقُرْآنَ بِرَأِيهِ and it was mentioned a very stern uh, threat of punishment for anyone who explains the Quran by their opinion فَأَنْ عَبْنْ عَبَاسٍ رَضِيَ اللَّهُ تَنْعَنْهُ قَالْ قَالَ رَسُولُ اللَّهِ صَلَى اللَّهُ عَلَيْهِ وَسَلَّمْ مَنْ قَالَ فِي الْقُرْآنَ بِرَأِيهِ فَلْيَتَّبَوَّأُ مَقْعْدُهُ مِنَ النَّارِ uh, and it was narrated in the hadith of Ibn Abbas and radiallahu ta'ala anhuma that the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, whoever explains the Quran by their opinion, then let them take their seat in the hellfire. وقال ولما سئل أبو بكر radiallahu ta'ala an an kawlihi wa faqihatin wa abba so also where Abu Bakr radiallahu ta'ala an, uh, he asked about the statement of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala where Allah tabaraka ta'ala says in Surah Al-Abbasa, وَفَاكِهَةً وَأَبَّا قَالْ أَيُّ الْأَرْضِ تُكِلُّنِي وَأَيُّ السَّمَاءٍ تُذِلُّنِي إِذَا قُلْتُ عَلَى اللَّهِ مَا لَا أَعْلَمْ and so after asking about that, he said, then which earth, you know, is going to, you know, cover me or protect me? And which sama, you know, which heaven or sky is going to provide me shade if I were to speak about a law based without knowledge? And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the Almighty, to accept our good and forgive our evil and bless us with ikhlas. With the Bible, the Sunnah, the Nabi, sallallahu alaihi wasallam, wa sallallahu alaihi wasallam, and the Nabi, Muhammad.